Zebras have stripes for a variety of reasons, and one of the most widely accepted explanations is protection through camouflage. In the grasslands where they live, the sharp contrast of black and white may seem obvious to human eyes, but to many predators, the pattern blends with tall grasses, shadows, and bright sunlight. This effect can break up the animal's outline, making it harder for predators to focus on a single target when the herd moves together. The stripes turn a group of zebras into a confusing moving pattern that helps keep them safe. Another major theory suggests that stripes help zebras avoid biting insects. Blood-sucking flies are attracted to large, dark-colored animals because they detect heat and movement. The alternating black and white pattern seems to disrupt the visual cues these insects use, causing them to land less often on striped surfaces. Experiments with patterned coats on other animals have shown that insects struggle to land properly on stripe-like patterns, suggesting that stripes act as a natural insect repellent. Social communication is also believed to play a big role in why zebras have stripes. Each zebra's stripe pattern is unique, similar to how humans have different fingerprints. This uniqueness allows individuals within a group to recognize each other quickly. Mothers can identify their young, members can stay close to their group, and zebras can maintain strong social bonds. Stripes become a visual signature that strengthens family and group relationships. Thermoregulation may be another reason for zebra stripes. The dark parts of the stripe absorb more heat, while the light parts reflect it. This creates tiny air movements across the animal's body, almost like built-in cooling vents. These small flows of air help reduce body temperature during extremely hot conditions. Scientists believe this system allows zebras to stay cooler compared to animals with solid dark coats. Stripes may also confuse predators through a phenomenon known as dazzle camouflage. When zebras run in groups, the shifting lines create a flickering, shimmering effect that can disorient animals chasing them. Instead of seeing one clear target, predators see a fast-moving maze of patterns. This makes it harder to judge speed, distance, and direction, helping zebras escape more effectively. Some scientists think stripes might serve as a way to reduce stress in group living. Because the patterns are so visually intense, they help zebras maintain personal space during chaotic situations like running or crossing rivers. The stripes create a natural visual boundary between individuals, helping to prevent collisions and panic within the herd. This may improve group survival during dangerous moments. Another idea is that stripes help with early learning and bonding. When a newborn zebra is first introduced to its family, the distinctive stripe pattern on its mother becomes one of the earliest visual cues it memorizes. The clear contrast allows young zebras to follow their mothers easily, even in a large herd. This early recognition is essential for feeding, protection, and developing social attachment. Stripes might also help zebras move more efficiently as a group. When one zebra shifts direction, the movement of its stripes becomes a signal that nearby individuals can quickly respond to. This creates coordinated, synchronized movement, especially useful when escaping from predators. The stripes act like visual signals that help maintain order and prevent confusion during sudden group actions. Some researchers believe stripes could have evolved as a passive deterrent for predators. Large animals with bold markings can sometimes appear more threatening or unfamiliar to potential attackers. The high contrast of a zebra's coat might give predators a moment of hesitation, especially in dim light or dense vegetation. Even a small delay can give the zebra just enough time to flee. While there is no single proven explanation, the most accepted view is that zebra stripes serve multiple purposes at once. Camouflage, insect protection, body cooling, social communication, and predator confusion all contribute to their survival. The stripes are an evolutionary masterpiece, shaped by millions of years of adaptation to challenging environments. Zebras are herbivores because their entire digestive system is adapted specifically for handling plant-based food, especially grasses. Their stomach and intestines are structured to process large amounts of fibrous material, 
something that carnivores or omnivores cannot efficiently break down. Their bodies evolved over millions of years to survive in vast grasslands where vegetation is abundant, but prey is not available for hunting. Grass is one of the most reliable food sources in the environments where zebras live. Instead of depending on hunting or scavenging, zebras take advantage of the endless supply of grasses that grow in their habitats. Grasses may not be very nutritious compared to meat, but they are always available, allowing zebras to maintain a stable and sustainable diet throughout the year. The teeth of zebras reveal that they are meant to be plant eaters. They have strong, flat molars that grind tough grasses into smaller pieces for easier digestion. Unlike predators, they do not have sharp fangs for tearing flesh. Their jaw structure also moves side to side, a motion perfect for grinding vegetation. This dental adaptation allows them to consume large amounts of grass every day. Zebras rely on a digestive strategy known as hindgut fermentation. This means that after food passes through their stomach, it enters a specialized part of the intestine where bacteria help break down tough plant fibers. This process allows them to extract nutrients from grass quickly and efficiently. Although this method is less efficient than a cow's multi-chambered stomach, it allows zebras to eat continuously and process food faster. Being herbivores also helps zebras avoid risky behaviors like hunting. Predatory animals must chase, kill, and overpower their prey which requires large bursts of intense energy and comes with the risk of injury. Zebras avoid these dangers entirely because feeding on grass is safe, abundant, and does not put them in direct conflict with other large animals. Zebras are built for endurance rather than attack. Their bodies are designed to travel long distances in search of grazing areas. Herbivorous animals need to eat for many hours each day because plants are low in calories. Zebras are excellent long-distance walkers and can keep moving across the landscape to find fresh grazing grounds, something predators cannot do as effectively. Their digestive system allows them to survive on grasses that many other animals cannot eat because the fibers are too tough. Instead of relying on soft leaves or fruits, zebras can thrive on thick, dry grasses that are difficult to digest. This gives them a strong survival advantage especially during drought seasons when other plant-eating animals struggle to find food. Zebras play an important role in shaping their ecosystem by being herbivores. As they graze, they keep grasses trimmed and healthy, preventing overgrowth. This encourages new plant growth and maintains the balance of the grasslands. Their grazing behavior also helps maintain open spaces, preventing bush encroachment and allowing other species to thrive. Living in groups also supports their herbivorous lifestyle. Zebras often live in large herds that move together from one feeding ground to another. Their cooperative behavior makes it easier to find safe places to graze. While some zebra groups eat, others stand guard, watching for dangers. This group strategy works well for animals that spend much of their day feeding with their heads down. Eating grass helps zebras remain highly alert and ready to run at any moment. Since they do not need to stalk or chase prey, they can conserve energy and stay prepared for predator attacks. Their bodies are always primed for quick escape, which is crucial for survival. Their diet allows them to maintain the high stamina required for sudden, powerful bursts of speed. Herbivory also reduces competition with other large animals. Predators compete with each other for meat, but zebras do not need to participate in this struggle. By focusing on vegetation, zebras can share their habitat with lions, hyenas, and other carnivores without directly competing for the same food sources. This separation of food choices helps maintain balance within the ecosystem. The shape and length of a zebra's neck also support a grass-eating lifestyle. Their necks are long enough to reach the ground comfortably for hours at a time. Their bodies are positioned so that they can graze without tiring quickly. Predators typically have shorter necks and do not spend most of their day eating. Zebras, in contrast, need this ability to survive on grass alone. Zebras have a digestive system that allows them to eat a wide variety of grasses, even those that are coarse, dry, or low in nutrients. This dietary flexibility helps them survive in environments with seasonal changes. When high-quality grass is scarce, Zebras can still feed on rougher vegetation, 
allowing them to endure harsh climates better than many other herbivores. Because grass is low in calories, zebras need to eat large amounts to maintain their energy. Their bodies evolved to accommodate this lifestyle by developing a digestive tract that processes high-volume diets efficiently. This constant feeding not only nourishes them, but also keeps them hydrated, as grasses contain moisture that contributes to their daily water intake. Herbivory gives zebras the ability to live in large herds without exhausting food resources. Grasslands can support thousands of grazing animals because plants grow back quickly. If zebras were carnivores, large herds would quickly deplete prey populations and collapse their ecosystem. Their plant-based diet allows them to live together in huge numbers without over-consuming resources. Zebras evolved as herbivores because it increased their chances of survival in the environments where their ancestors lived. Over time, natural selection favored individuals who could digest tough plants, travel great distances, and live in large herds. These traits helped zebras survive predators, droughts, and competition, eventually shaping them into the grass-eating animals they are today. Their herbivorous nature also influences their behavioral patterns. Because they need to graze for many hours, zebras often feed during early mornings and late afternoons when temperatures are cooler. This schedule helps them conserve energy and stay alert. Their daily routine revolves around finding safe places to eat while avoiding predators. Being herbivores also allows zebras to develop predictable migration patterns. They follow the seasonal growth of grasses, moving from dry areas to greener pastures when food becomes scarce. These migrations ensure that zebras always have access to vegetation, and the predictable movement helps other species, including predators, know where to find prey. Grass-eating behavior supports zebras' high reproductive success. Plant-based diets are easier to obtain consistently, allowing mothers to stay healthy and produce milk for their young. A stable food supply is essential for raising strong, healthy offspring. Because grass is abundant, zebras rarely face starvation, giving their young a better chance of reaching adulthood. Ultimately, zebras are herbivores because it is the lifestyle that best fits their physical structure, environment, and survival strategies. Their teeth, digestive system, social habits, and daily routines are all shaped by millions of years of evolution centered around eating grass. This plant-based diet has allowed zebras to thrive, multiply, and become one of the most recognizable animals of the African plains.